Hey guys, it's OT from David Dummy, and welcome to another video. And so I am bored, so I have nothing very to do. So tomorrow I'm raw at the Superstar Shake Up, where they're gonna take some stars from Raw and SmackDown, put them on different brands, and see what happened. We made some new matchups and things interesting. So I thought I would uh, tell you some superstars that I think should be going from Raw to SmackDown, from SmackDown to Raw. Some, like, maybe bring up some NST people, so, let's get started, uh, this is no in particular order, I, uh, so let's start with Raw, I think, Boston Hug Connection, is first off, stupid name, second of all, Boston Hug Connection should go to SmackDown, and I think this because, at WrestleMania 35, spoilers, uh, uh, the Iconics, who is a SmackDown Live team, beat the Boston High Connection, a Raw team, for the SmackDown Women, for, not SmackDown, uh, the Women Championships. So, I think if, I think the best way to do this is to have the Boston High Connection move over to SmackDown, so they can actually build some storyline between the two teams for a rematch at Backlash or no merch. Whatever pay-per-view is after WrestleMania. It used to be a stream rules every year, but now they changed it. Changed the name, changed everything. What a pay-per-view, so yeah. So, mm-hmm. So, uh, what, what was I gonna say? So yeah, put the Boston High Connection on SmackDown so it's easier to build a storyline between the two teams for a rematch down the line. Nuts. I think, well, this is sort of a double switch. I think the U.S. and Intercontinental Championship should change brands. I think Finn Balor should go to SmackDown. Samoa Joe should go to Raw. I would love to see so many Intercontinental Championship matches. So, all these matches are in the title, uh, with the title on the line. Finn Balor versus Daniel Bryan for the Intercontinental Championship. That would be cool. Finn Balor versus... Kevin Owens, like from the old takeover days and stuff like that, that would be cool. Finn Bauer versus uh who else is going to matter? Uh I'm thinking real quick. Oh maybe Finn Bauer and Sheamus, that'd be a cool matchup. But um uh, just so so many. Finn Bauer versus Shelton Benjamin. So many cool matchups you could have. And then on the raw side Samoa Joe versus Drew McIntyre. Samoa Joe versus Mojo Rawley. Okay, I thought I said cool. But <laughs> Samoa Joe versus Seth Rollins. Samoa Joe versus Roman Reigns. Actually, no, not that map. I saw it way too many times. I do not need to see it again. Samoa Joe versus. Versus Zack <laughs> Ryder. I don't know. I can't think of any. Right now, I'm not in the real wrestling thing. Samoa Joe teamed up with Bobby Lashley to take on uh, Zack Ryder and Kyle Hawkins. They go for a tattoo, though. That, that, okay, not too bad. Okay. Now, I think Drew McIntyre should move over to SmackDown, is my next one. Uh, McIntyre's been on Raw too long. I think he should move over to SmackDown. That'd be a nice change of scene for him. So, I would not mind McIntyre being on SmackDown. So now let's go over to SmackDown. Who should go over to Raw to be red? I think... Oh, one more. One more thing. I think Breezango should go over to SmackDown. Back to SmackDown. So, I can see more Tyra Breeze and up, up, down, down. Uh, with Xavier Woods in a new day on SmackDown. So, I think just to make it easier to record video, so put them back on SmackDown. You're not doing a whole lot with them. Breeze in a couple single matches on Dongo. Is he still recovering from his broken leg? Anyway, so yeah. Now, some. Well, I guess I can throw a woman in there too. Throw Ember Moon over to SmackDown. That'd be cool. Ember Moon versus Mandy Rose. Ember Moon versus Oscar. Let's build a feud out of that. That'd be that'd be just cool. That would be really cool. Like, back in NFT, that'd be so cool to redo that. That would be cool. If they did it correctly. Now, over from SmackDown to Raw. Um, I'm thinking that we should move. Um, should I think of SmackDown 
talent knocked down. I think we had a good brothers. Gallows and Anderson. Not doing anything with them that much. Move them over to Raw. The reason I'm why I'm doing it, you might hear that. I'm reaching over in my wrestling bin <laughs> looking for superstars and it might remind me of some other ones. Biggie and the new day. Anyway, um I think that Hmm. Should face then truth over the raw? No, that seven second dance break thing is great. Yeah, um I think they should send the bar the good brother over. They should also send um I'm thinking of WrestleMania matches to see who they should ship back over to Raw. Well, um Hmm. No one coming to mind really, I really should have wrote this down. Okay, but so some people that need to come up from NXT. We need to see Pete Dunne on Raw. I want to see Pete Dunne versus Seth Rollins for the Universal Championship. That would be awesome. That'd be really, really cool. Pete Dunne versus Seth Rollins. And if also from NXT, I want to see the Undisputed Era come up and go to SmackDown, and so they can beat up on the bar. And Bruce Evan Macamora and the Usos and Ricker Black. I mean Alistair Black and Ricochet. And they, I don't know they were have a team name, but anyway, so that was this quick little video. And these are some just some of my ideas for who should be traded not traded. Given not given. Swapped sides, not swapped. Go to the other side, no. Trade no, I don't know. Go to the other brand. There. Uh and anyway, while I'm on this uh, why do I get Becky both titles? Is she, what show is she gonna be on? That'd be just funny if she could send back down to NST. I should make a whole other video on what's wrong with the day because I have a lot of things. So, uh, I'll see you guys in the next video. Oh, one more thing. One more thing. Samoa Joe. Oh, I almost, I already said Samoa Joe over the raw. <laughs> I'm like, wait. Oh yeah, I want to see Braun Strowman versus Samoa Joe for the US title. That's one more thing. See ya.